Hey guys, Fly Girl VSG coming into you with my week 154. I'm looking for my water bottle and I can't find it. <laughs> um, I'm also about to start cooking a soup, another soup for a recipe to be determined. Um, I'm making a broccoli cheddar soup actually, so um, for book club tonight. So I'm just coming into you with a super, super fast update because I've been so busy. Um, last week, okay, so I didn't make an update last week and I'll tell you why. I just couldn't. Like, I just couldn't. So I'm three weeks married tomorrow. <laughs> and it took me until, like, late last week for me to, like, get my shit together. So when I weighed in last Thursday, I was, like, almost 219. <laughs> and I was, like, oh, fuck no. Like, I could not come onto YouTube and be accountable to that. I couldn't do it. Um, I weighed in today at 2152 um, and I've seen anywhere between 213 and 216 on the scale this week. So I am definitely doing a little bit more of a whole food, lower carb um, thing. I haven't been back to the gym yet since before the wedding, <sighs> mainly because I went to go to the gym on Monday and I was not feeling very good. And then I went, to, okay, I'm like, okay, I'm set. I got all dressed and everything on Tuesday, but I slept funny on my neck. And since the accident, my neck is really susceptible to pain. So I literally couldn't like, I was like this, I couldn't. I couldn't do it. So, um, sorry, I'm getting a messenger message. Deleting, delete. So, um, let's see what else. Mm -mm -mm. So, yeah, I'm basically the same as I have been if ish the last couple months. But, um, yeah. I'm doing better, though. Um, I'm still having a little bit of a candy issue. My alcohol intake's much better. Um, so, yeah, I've been kind of just reducing um, carbs this week, increasing, you know, like, not just watching more protein and veggies and just kind of eating more like that um, than I have in a while and limiting the um, processed carb stuff. So... Yeah, I'm definitely feeling better um, overall, but uh, really distracted today because I have to make a soup and I just got back from lunch with a friend and I'm looking for a car. I think I'm going to go with the Toyota Camry, but I don't really like, I, I don't know. I, I'm not in love. I want a Nissan Murano. Let's be honest. I want a Nissan Murano. I do not have the budget for a Nissan Murano, but that's what I want. Mama wanted me somewhere, I don't know. I told my friend today, I was like, I just feel like when I get into the car, I'm just going to know. And I test drove a Nissan Altima, and I test drove a Hyundai Sonata, and I test drove a Nissan uh, Camry. And the only car I've ever felt that way about, other than the car that I just donated in May, was the Nissan Murano, because I've rented Nissan Muranos before. And I want one so bad. But my husband will not let me spend that kind of money. And we really don't need that much of a car. A sedan is perfectly within our needs. We do not have kids. We do not, you know, camp a lot. We're not going to be sleeping in the car. It's fine. So anyway, that's where I'm at um, this week. Other th otherwise, things are going good. You know, just... Um, going to go to a Halloween party this year. Um, let me ask you this. I'm thinking I'm going to go as a ghost bride, but I don't know if I should wear a black velvet dress or a, like, my white off-the-shoulder dress that I wore to my bachelorette party and my shower because it's white, but I can also wear tights and boots with it. Or my wedding dress. I don't even know if I'll fit into my wedding dress. But do you think it would be weird to wear my wedding dress with like a big wig and white face makeup and black, you know, like zombie eyes kind of. Not zombie eyes, but like dead, really heavy black um, ghost eyes. But like paint my fate white, face white like I'm a dead person, you know. I don't know. Should I wear the dress? I don't know. I'm really on the fence about it. Or I can wear a white dress in general and wear a really pretty blue and white masquerade ball mask and go with my other friend who's wearing black and a kind of a black lacy masquerade mask and she would be dark and I would be light. But I do have all the stuff that um, for the, uh, I do have all the, where's my water bottle? I do have all the stuff for the ghost bride. They don't take refunds at the Halloween store. So, by the way, my water bottle is not in the fridge. I don't know why I did I'm like looking in there. Anyway, um, so I guess I'll just have to get a glass. 
Asylum restaurant from Jerome, Arizona, which is where I had Halloween dinner. Not last year, but the year before. Not the year before. It was three years ago with Tessa. I got that glass. Jerome, Arizona. Mmm, I'm so thirsty. I've not had any water today. That's not true. I had 30 ounces of water, but I haven't had any water for several hours, so I need to catch up. I'm trying to drink just one of these a day, not more than one. This is 64 ounces. I find that I actually do really well in the sweet spot between 64 ounces and like 84 ounces, but if I drink more than that, I seem to hold on to it, so I didn't know that, but... Anyway, I'm really just blabbing. I just, I felt bad about not coming in last week and I didn't want to go another week without coming in. Basically, everyone's like, how are you? And I'm like, fat, really fat, honestly. I'm really fucking fat and I'm really unhappy about it, but I'm happy in my life right now, so it's like not a huge priority. <laughs> like it is, it is a priority. I don't mean to say it like that, but like I have so much going on right now between like just cleaning up the wedding stuff and going into the holidays and book club and trying to cook and meal plan and like get my life together and um what else I'm just gonna clean the fridge clean 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 the outside of the fridge while I'm talking to you um car shopping catching up with friends and family I've been ignoring for three months because you know of the wedding festivities and so anyway blah 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 <sighs> okay <laughs> Um, keep it fly out there. You guys have a great weekend. Happy Halloween weekend. Woohoo. I'll see you guys next week for sure. Mwah. Bye.